Now that our dressing room's open. So we moved here about three years ago from North Dakota. All we knew about sauna was you sit in there and get sweaty. My brother-in-law, he's in the Twin Cities, and he was a co-op member of 612 Sauna Society. So he invited us down to come sauna with him down there. Traditional sauna is a lot warmer. It's a totally different experience than like your YMCA or your hotels. You know, these are about 180 to 190, and those are about 140. It's kind of a cardio workout. Your heart gets pumping, it dilates your blood vessels. It gets your pores cleaned out. You get a really good sweat on, and then you come out to the snow, and I always stop right before I get in the snow, but basically I just, I just start tipping so I don't have a choice. And then I, I like to run, you know, uh, brush the snow on top of myself, and I count to 60. I try to count to 60 anyways, but that's, it's, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> it's a very fast 60. And then your heart rate slows down some, and you stop sweating, and then you stand up, and then the 15 degree air doesn't feel so bad. We loved it, we relaxed, slept better that night than we had for, since we, you know, for years probably. So we said, let's build one. Like the idea of being able to pull it to Duluth's scenic areas. So we bought a fish house, repurposed it basically, remodeled it into a sauna. So we bought it January of uh, 2017 and I started digging into it. Lots of time on the internet researching, you know, how do you build something mobile and then how do you build a sauna? You know, no one had done both too often, so I researched about as much as I actually built. Our first event was Winter Village, the first weekend of December of 2018. So we've been doing it for about three months now. We love it. The community has embraced it so, so well. We kind of get into this box where that's, you know, going to work another day, here's the weekend. But when you can do something outside that box, it'll trigger those endorphins and it makes you feel good, I guess. Those endorphins is really what's giving you a little buzz.